Hey Adventures Every Day, we're Ryan here. We're headed out for another adventure. We're headed to Yarnell from Wickenburg. We're headed through the desert on some main roads that uh, lead up and climb up the mountain to Yarnell. Stay tuned. As we went through the washes in Wickenburg on the Hacienda River, Rowan was very excited to see a couple of horses walking through. She enjoys that very much. And as you see, we're headed through the desert, through the wash at the Hacienda towards uh, Yarnell. Uh, you know, it was very rocky. You can see some pictures here. We found a little gorge that we could walk through. You... There was water for us to play in. Rowan was very excited because she loves water. However, we were, I was very excited too because it was getting a little warm, so we needed a little cool down time. So we went and played in the water a little bit. At this point, I had a club member video me and Rowan going through the water and making, you know, a big splash. We were hot and we wanted to have a little bit of fun. Rowan loves the water again. So we went. This next part of the trail is really fun. It's kind of technical, but not slow enough where you got too hot, but technical in, in its own right. As we entered Yarnell, Arizona, we stopped at the Granite Mountain uh, Hot Shots Memorial, where Rowan was very excited to see it and had lots of questions. We sat there for a little bit to uh, talk about what happened, how it happened, and she was very intrigued, very sad that the lives were lost, and that I think she had a better respect for our lost heroes here. This today we stop here on the 10 year anniversary of this fire. Looks like an old dynamite. Cozy little home, isn't it? Cozy little home. You want to live out here? We came across this house that we saw on the bottom of the hill that is just out in the middle of nowhere. As you're rolling up, you're seeing that there's a there was once an active mine at the base of this mountain. So we're assuming that this house here used to be the owners of that mine site. Um, when talking with some of the locals, this house was fairly intact a year to year and a half ago and people just came up here and vandalized it. Ripped the roofs down, the walls down, did burnouts in the carport area here. Um, this house was fairly large in its heyday and it had pretty good potential but just sad to see the destruction that people do to these places. <laughs> 